All right, so once our 360 is complete, we now need to de-energize the vehicle. We've stabilized it. We need to make sure that the airbags are disconnected as well as uh, the batteries. Turn on our hazards, and now we have an indicator to know when our battery's been disconnected. When we come up to the engine compartment, we've got a couple techniques in which we can use. One's gonna be utilizing a crease. We're gonna crease with either our halogen or our ax. We're gonna bury our pike end of the ax and then we're gonna fold up the end to expose the battery. Remember when we're disconnecting the battery, we want the negative cable first and then the positive after just to prevent any sparking. Now that we've exposed the corner, we've got access to where the battery would be. Uh, in this vehicle, the battery's already been removed, but we have access to cut the negative and then the positive cables afterwards. If we were to do that and the battery wasn't uh, in a position where we could actually utilize this technique, the next technique we can use is grab our spreaders and we want to defeat the hinges on both sides and we'll defeat the hinges and then we'll spin the hinge or the lid off of the, the front of the hinge. defeated the hinge on that side, now we're just going to come and do the exact same thing on the passenger side of the vehicle. This way we don't run the risk of having to try to uh, defeat this front latch and uh, get the lid to engage that way. We're able to defeat the hinges and get it out of the way. It's a much quicker process.